Hey everybody, I Heart Movies here, and welcome back to Let's Play Wild Arms 2. Last episode, we made our way through the, em the uh, emulator zone, got our way out of there, we're now back to the uh, actual, you know, world and all that, and run our way towards Dildalad to deliver the uh, Master's son back to his dad and stuff. Uh, ditch the cargo to make sure we can get through the uh, dimensional seam, otherwise, we would have been, you know, eaten in time, which, you know, would have sucked. So here we are. Um, Gilder Lad is over this way. Um, probably easy to tell where it is given the uh, layout of the uh, map here. And what did you know? I am right on top of it. And yeah, here we got a big old blank town here. Blank as in industrial. I didn't want to really spoil all that, although we kind of already knew that Gilder Lad was an industrial place anyway. So here we are. By the way, love the uh, town theme here. Fits the bill perfectly for the uh, area that we're in right now, anyhow. Yeah, we'll be, we'll be making our way through all around here in due time. This part can actually be... Well, I keep saying parts. The, uh, this town can be a, a little mazy. What the hell is that? Kind of looks like the uh, dinosaur, actually. What is the uh, remains of a dinosaur, anyhow? It's actually not a dinosaur; it just looks like one. We'll find out more about that here shortly, actually. So, just a little tidbit for right now. Oh, so uh, hey, we brought your son back here. Um, about the cargo. Eh, uh, yeah, yeah, about that. <laughs> um, okay, I get it. you're steaming. You're like a steamed vegetable, only smarter. That's cool. But your son's alive. Shouldn't that be a little more important than cargo? Which, by the way, what was even in the cargo anyway? They never did tell us, actually. Not that it was really our business or anything. But, you know, yeah. Silence, I kill you! Um, yeah. Yeah, you think that'd be, uh, the more important thing here. Oh. Oh. Hadn't thought of that, actually. But wait, if it was the freight cars that they were after, what was in them that made it so important anyway? Hey, what could be on them that was more important than your own son? Yeah, that's... Yeah, that's that's a moot point. But what could there have been? That's the thing. Oh. Oh. Well, that's... That's a big deal. Oh, bitch stuff going on right here. Oh, hmm. But wait, that's a pretty small weapon, don't you think? Given that there's only one actual cart on the train with cargo? Because you had the front part of the train, the middle part where we were on, and the caboose, which is where the weapon was, apparently. But I mean, it could have been that big a deal, was it? Yeah, that was kind of lame. <laughs> so, do we know what the super weapon actually is? So we can kind of learn more about it? Yeah, there you go, Loco. She knows what's up. Yeah, I mean, he wants to help you all but us. Oh, hi, Odessa. Um, where are they now? That's not the Varakaisas, obviously. And of course, as we all know, lost technology is always better than current technology. Standard rule of role-playing games and all that. The unwanted byproduct of industrial sorcery. That just sounds cool to say that.
Oh, uh, that's true. Just the fact that you have one. Yeah, they can use that to kind of tip this, this balance, the scale towards them, essentially. And you, uh, Grosswine? Um, that does not sound good. Like, at all. By the way, I hope you guys are kind of enjoying, actually, the, uh, almost new style of commentary, the kind of quieter, mellower commentary, actually. I think I've, I've been a big fan of it so far, myself. I mean, I'm able to say things more clearly, I can talk slower, which to me is huge, you have no idea. So yeah, it's actually been really, really helpful, I think. That's a, yeah, that's a good question. Oh, that's true, they want to... Well, they want it for compensation, because they all have small penises. <laughs> Okay, there's a little more serious reason than that, but, you know. Hmm, what's up? Well, yeah, but how so? Well, I, I kinda know why. Mm hmm, that's true. You are wise beyond your years. That is, that is true. That is true. Oh, well, yeah, it kind of is. Because, I mean, they're a group of, what, five people? And they want to run the entire world. Yeah, that's easier said than done. Well, right now, things are kind of working on, uh, working for them, because, you know, they have Grozwine now, apparently. They have the Heimdall Grozo. Oh, hey, works for me. Take all the all the help we'll get. Ooh, upgrade your hovercraft. And a port feature. Ah, nice. Essentially, now that means uh, when we teleport somewhere with the uh, teleport or orb, it'll come with us. Actually, so you know that's cool and everything there. Oh, I need to fix up my uh, formation here. Actually. Um, okay, so um, anything new here? That's um, that's a good question, actually. I do not have any idea. Uh, maybe Liz and Art again? They were working as spies before. Well, at this point now, the uh, being deceived thing is not a big deal, as opposed to the fact that they have a freaking nuclear weapon. I think that kind of is a little more important here right now. Okay, so I want to go ahead and... Uh, find some stuff around here. We got a, uh, of course the shops around here as per the, uh, you know, RPG norm. Uh, can I drop down from up here? You kind of can, actually. Oh, wait. Um, oh, there's this. Um, yeah, there's a lever for that around here somewhere. I forget where. I will find it, though. So, yeah. Um, here we go. Um, okay, imagine if you so need. I do want to reload my arm, though. Okay, um, what's down this way? Um, oh, here we go. Shops. I like shops. There you go. All new stuff here, which I definitely want to buy. Alright, just enough money to buy everything. I like that. Well, I have a lot of stuff, actually. Okay, I'm just gonna sell all this. There we go. Do I need any items while I'm here? I'm not sure. Uh, no, not really, actually. Works for me. That's the thing, I hardly ever use the uh, status carrying items, like, at all, because eventually what it spells to, uh, well, that'll heal that, obviously. Um, anything else this way? Uh, oh, personal skill shop. How many points am I up to now? Uh, 433. Three. Okay, I do want to get a skill for me while I'm here, actually. Um, restore HP would be nice. Um, ooh, up magic defense. That wouldn't be terrible. Um, actually, let's go for up physical attack. I don't personally need it because I will actually is a uh, more of a physical character anyway, so he doesn't quite need it as much. But the points are there, so you may as well at least put one point into it, really. 
Okay, so let's keep on exploring while we're here. Find out more about Guild Galad. Hello. Um, yeah. Just flashier. That kind of goes against what Noel was saying before, you think. Because he was saying he prefers an unpretentious train, he prefers the products to be unpretentious, and yet their people dress really flashy. That kind of doesn't seem to fit together, actually. Which is me, you look at the town here, actually, you think, almost think like, like 1800s Industrial Revolution sort of thing, actually. I mean, that's just what I get from the, the vibe of this place, but that's just me. Is that all you say? You are worthless, madam. What's this thing? Ooh, of a dragon! Nice! You were not about to make a Star Wars reference right there. <laughs> I never caught that before, actually. This fool right here tried to make a Star, War Star Wars reference. He almost did. Props to you, sir. Props to you. Uh, but yeah, let's, let's explore. Let me also fix my headset. Okay, there we go. It was uh, kind of slipping off my head a little bit here. I'm kind of leaning forward, actually, as I'm uh, recording right now. Um, but anyway, yeah, there's a locked door around here that we saw earlier. Um, well, uh, I'll keep an eye out for her. I'm sure she's around somewhere. But anyway, um, yeah, there is a lever around here to open that locked door, uh, which leads to stuff. I hope to find it. Hello? Hello? So I'm assuming you're 10? Um, no, I really can't. Ooh, duplicator door. Nice. Um, I do have three duplicators. Nice. I shall use one. Love the jingle there. Ah. Right, what do we have here? I'm gonna say these are all crests. I'm getting that, that vibe. Nice. Hey, words for me. I'll take it. Oh, um, that reminds me, actually. Now that we have the teleport orb, um, when we go back to the world map, there's stuff I want to do, actually. Um, back over the, uh, Selje region, I should be able to do more stuff. Um, I totally forgot, actually. Um, I will get to that here, if not today, um, very soon. Hi! Um, he's actually on the opposite side of wherever the hell we are now. So if you walk around in a circle long enough, you'll find each other eventually. But yeah, this pretty much goes around in a gigantic circle of sorts. Um, this should be the uh, throne room right here, actually. Yeah, um, okay, oh wait, um... Trying to remember, there's that lever around here somewhere. Here's their uh, headquarters for a meeting, for their meeting room, whatever stuff, things, words. I say them. Um, yeah, this part, it's not really that big, but yeah, just how it's designed is really, really amazing. Hello, <laughs> the Lord of the Library. So essentially, you're a nerd, pretty much. Okay, now where is that damnable lever? It's around here somewhere, I know it is. <sighs> I will find you, lever. When I do, I will kill you. And by kill you, I mean turn you on. Oh my god, that sounds wrong. <laughs> oh wait, uh... Here we go, the small switch, there it is. Uh, that was a lever, actually. Like, <laughs> I was really hung on the idea that it was a lever. Um, okay, it's not a lever, it is a, uh, a little switch. Okay, um, I believe it was right over here? Yes, indeedy. And what do we have in here? Another crest cap, nice. I might use that, but not right now, that's for sure. But, uh, later. Okay, so, um, what should we do now? We, uh, got Noel back, um... We should probably call the Chateau. Might not be a terrible idea. Oh, what you got, Amy? Um... Sure. Okay, well we can either go to Damson, or we're going to Holst, or we can do some side quests, which I'll be doing next time on Let's Play Wild Arms 2. This has been Iron Movie signing off, guys. Have a great day, and thanks for watching.